Good morning, Whitman Wildcats. Welcome to school today. It is May the 4th. Welcome to another galactic day of learning and fun at Whitman School. All right. Thank you for that wonderful music. And I just want to say this. We are going to have a great day today. Are there any birthdays today? There is only one birthday today, and, and that person is Brooklyn B. So I hope you have a very happy birthday. And how about that weather? The weather today will be a high of 48 and a low of 38. Thank you. How about our menu for today? Our menu for today is pizza rotini bake, mixed vegetables, a mixed green salad with sweet red pepper sticks, red salad, red salad dressing, wedges mini <laughs> bread sticks, margarine, ma margarine strawberries, uh, ice cream, and a choice of milk. And for tomorrow's lunch, we'll be having chicken and gravy over creamy mashed potatoes, steamed broccoli, pan roll, and margarine blueberries, and a choice of milk. So good lunch. Awesome. Thank you for that. Miss Clemens, do you have any special announcements for today? Oh, Miss Amy, you know I do because it's Teacher Appreciation Day 3. So I have a couple of things. I have a challenge for the teachers today or a trivia question, and I have a trivia question for the students. So two questions. Everybody gets to play along and have some fun today with our Teacher Appreciation Week. So here is the first trivia question, and this one is for the teachers. So please make sure you're listening because you're going to have to email me your answer, and I'm going to take the fourth person and the twelfth person that email me the correct answer to go into the raffle or they'll get a prize on Friday. And then for the students, I'm gonna have the bucket in the office where you can put your answers in there like we do when we normally have trivia. So one person from each class can bring the trivia answers down and we'll do a raffle for you guys as well. So here are the questions. Are you ready? Teachers, where in the school can you stand on a spot and be in, on four different colored tiles? It's a tricky one, but there is a spot. Where in the building can you stand and be on four different colored square tiles? That's for the teachers. Here's the student question, trivia question for today. Where in the United States can you stand it's a two-parter and be in four different states. I want you to tell me what that place is called because it's a monument, I believe. And I want you to tell me what the four states are. So where in the United States can you stand and be in four different states at the same time? Trivia for Wednesday. Have some fun with that. Make it work, Wildcat. All and right, Amy, Amy I have a question for you. Yes. Are you my father? Yes, I am your father. <laughs> Forgive me. I wish I could talk like him. I, you know I wish I could, but sorry. All right. All right. But I do have this. I have the students of the month. These students were consistently industrious. That's a great thing to be. Miss Vosco's class, Aaliyah. And then also for K-5, Michael, Miss Kelly's class. Uh, let's see, I'm going skipping to Miss Hanson, Kimora Guyton, Miss Lafferty's class, Seth Neeb, uh, Miss Sarah Schultz class, Wahid, Miss Zia, Lily Manley, Miss Christensen, Joel Combs, Miss Quesada's class, Manuel, Miss Scoma's class, Julian Rangel Rios, Mr. Netterfield's class, Emilio Gonzalez, Mr. Johnson's class, Oscar. Ms. Roscoe's class, Jaden Tibbetts, Mr. Dunbeck, uh, Angelica Ranick, Ms. Milos, Osvaldo Sandoval, and Mr. John's class, Olivia Belt. Kudos to all of you industrious students. Everyone, I hope you enjoy this galactic day of learning and fun at Whitman School. May the fourth be with you.